Later on South Today, Sam Fraser has the weather forecast and treading, or rather tapping, the boards. Here's Ed Salt. 25 years of river dance. The show is back in the south and I'm fulfilling a childhood dream. OK, now, it was, in fact, the interval act that upstaged the main show. Just cast your mind back to 1994, Eurovision Song Contest in Dublin and a taste of traditional Irish dancing. That was when they were always winning it, wasn't it? Yeah. Except uh, there was nothing traditional about it and suddenly a global audience of 300 million people was completely transfixed by an act called River Dance. Well, now it's 25th anniversary tour. We'll see theatres across the south literally shake to the sound of drum and dance. Ed Twinkletoes <laughs> Salt, who apparently always wanted to follow in Michael Flatley's footsteps, met up with the cast ahead of their show in Bournemouth. 1994, and this was the moment we first heard the sound of river dance. It made stars of Michael Flatley and Jean Butler and catapulted a love of Irish dancing right around the world. And that love is still there. Over two decades on, River Dance is back, rehearsing in Bournemouth today as the show kicks off its UK tour. And one man has been there from the very start. It's been extraordinary. It has been, because it has been, you don't want to use the word world, world dominating, but we've been around the world and we've played in all the major cities and venues around the world over and over. This is this our 12th tour of the UK. I mean, it, it, so it, it's, com it, it's really surprising that this show that started out from such a simple premise, people are just so blown away still by the show. Maeve, Bobby, thank you very much indeed for letting me come and interrupt rehearsals. I've got to admit that this is almost fulfilling a childhood ambition for me. Believe it or not, I used to dance in front of the original video yeah. uh, to River Dance, <laughs> and I'm on stage with you now. Could you possibly teach me a few steps? We will. We're, We're going to teach you okay. the, the class. It's called the River Dance Step. Okay. It's the one that everyone sees and knows of when everyone's in a line, Sorry, legs go in mayhem. Brilliant. So what okay. we do, as you know, yeah. we don't really use our arms too much. No, so in, arms down. So you're going to put your right foot in front of your left to start with. OK, so we're right. going to go hop. Hop. One. One. Two. Push, pull. And then the left leg is going to come up to the right hip. Okay. Two, three. Were you even born, Bobby, when River Dance started? I was one of the only ones that's left that was born, but that's given away my age. So a lot of this cast weren't actually born, so they've grown up in a world where there was always River Dance. Your legs must get absolutely tired, <laughs> and your feet must be really painful. It does get hard, but, like, we have a physio, we get massages three times a week and stuff like that, so you're constantly being looked after. And I guess, like, we are athletes. When you, when you do a sport for your job, you have to take care of your body, so... We're smart about it as well. Seven, eight. One, two, three, up. Now, be honest, you can't tell the difference, can up. you? One, two, three. I think I'm getting up. the hang of this. Oh, just a few more hours, that's all he needs. I see hours. you do that after a double gin and slim yeah, line. Look at my doing it. absolutely brilliant here. It's just, see, just it's, such it's a shame we've got the, top the table. Part of the body, isn't yeah. it? It's like, it's like swans. You know, paddling That's like it. fury underneath, but looking graceful on the top. And if you can't make the Bournemouth performances, uh, you can visit them seeing Portsmouth, Oxford and Southampton over the next couple of months. River dance. Enough. Do you remember when French and Saunders did it? I oh, do remember French and Saunders doing it. Very funny, very funny.